Robert Downsy. Robert Downsy Jr. Robert Downsy Jr. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Two Drink Minimum, the number one Down Syndrome podcast on the planet. The man in front of me has had many fights with many people with the Downs. Comedy legend, Mike Ward. I'm the Waterhead King. Yes. I am Mike Ward. You are Pantelis, uh-huh. our friend here. Is Poseidon, yeah. and we have Preach on the yes. episode this week. Again. Who, who Again. isn't, uh, doesn't have Down syndrome, but his head is four times bigger it's than four, someone yeah. with Down syndrome. <laughs> yeah. no, my, my, my motorcycle helmet is a 5XL. Yeah. When I, I didn't know shop for that way. What, Yeah, I didn't know either. When I shop for a helmet, they look at me like I have an ish. But, yeah. If you sent, your head is so big, if you sent your mom to buy your helmet, they'd be like, is your son going to use this to eat soup with? A hundred percent. A hundred percent. Your community doesn't abort, right? Jeez. That's what this is? Big ass head. I'm like, no, he's got a T-Rex. Hmm. Reason for the big head. Uh. <laughs> Anyways. Uh. Yo, Breaching, how you been? How you guys been? Good I've traveling. I've been you in Asia, motherfucker. Yeah. yeah. Like, we, I, Well, I was in Europe. Yeah, and then before I that, I was in Europe. And yeah. before, I was in Europe. Before that, I was in New York. Before that, I was in Europe. Yeah. Like, the last month, like, I've been with my girlfriend for a couple of months. And I, she was like, we've been traveling a lot. I was like, not that much. We just did Florida, New York. We went to Jersey. We went to Switzerland. We went to Belgium. We went to France. We went to fucking... And then I was like, oh, shit, yeah. That's a lot. Never mind. <laughs> I've, I've slept in my bed uh, three times in the last two months. I right slept now. in his bed five yeah. times. Weird. Weird. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, yeah, man. It's like... you. He's a good cuddler. I was... <laughs> I know, man. Yeah. It's that beard. Okay, it's crafty. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, I was like, you you invited me to go to uh to uh can yeah like, couldn't can. and I was pissed about oh, that. Oh, that would have been so fun. Yeah. That would have been really fun. I wanted to go to Toronto. Couldn't. Oh, Toronto. Oh, if Toronto. We had you, if we had you in Toronto, dude, you God would have damn. seen the return of Bourgo. The- Oh, you would have seen the return of the Mac. Me and you are having this like a movie moment. So the first appearance of Burgo, I was in the audience live watching and being like, what is yeah. happening? And you would have had the same experience as yeah. Toronto. You would have like, what is happening? Yeah. I got my cousin, her and her her, uh, her boyfriend. You you met him, right? And, and you probably don't remember because it was a long ass time ago. But she always sends me like, she sees this shit live. You know? Okay. okay. So okay. She's she was hardcore. like, she, and she was like, She's a fan. She's fan. So she, yeah, she's a fan fan of her, 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 her man. And she's like, uh, she sends me this. She's yeah. like, woo. And I'm like, yeah. Uh, and, and she says, tu penses qu'il fait exprès? On est juste au début. She come. I'm like, no, he's, yeah. he's not. It was amazing, though, because w- when he showed up, he was like, he was doing jokes and callbacks about the episode with yeah. you. And I was like. I was like, be oh, fuck, this is going to be amazing. He goes, look, you have to be able to make fun of yourself. You have to be, if you're not able to laugh at yourself, then what's the point? So I'm like, this is going to be awesome. The show starts, we make fun of him, and he's like, what? And he, he got fucking like, shut down. super angry. Yeah, yeah. And then Van Dels was like, uh, but do you have stories about like when you were living in Vancouver? What do you mean? No, but like, do you have like, did shit happen when you? What? No. Why? Why would shit happen? We're like, <laughs> dude, God it was damn, it's a fucking. It was podcast. like pulling teeth. It was, dude, it was like pulling. And then at one point, he's like, I feel. He's like, the like, I feel like I'm on two drink minimum. I feel God, like no, you guys are no. attacking me. I mean, God, and we dude. weren't trying to attack him. We were actually. I wanted to hear because I'm sure he has. You know, we have stories about just here yeah. the open mic scene. You know, yeah. there's a lot of retarded people. I'm like, yeah. imagine different cities. Yeah. This guy probably saw the craziest shit, and he didn't want to answer. He thought we were fucking with him. I don't know, man. Go, go, shout outs to you, but yeah. He's fun, though. Like, he he's a let's go king. Yeah. Like, uh, he's, <laughs> he's rocky. Less, he's he's, he's rocky. King. He gets yeah. fucking rattled, but he always fucking yeah, he gets d- back up. Yeah. You knock him down 10 times, this guy is up 12. Yeah. <laughs> one time he fell by himself. He also <laughs> don't know how to count, but yeah, <laughs> he fell down. If I fell down, yeah, I fell down. So it wasn't my fault. I didn't knock him down. He just <laughs> fell down. But it, it, it was wild doing that episode. The comedy bar was beautiful. Uh, but it, it was wild doing that episode there, thinking in my head, like you going in, I was like, this can be so much fun. It's just going to be winning the crowd over. It's going to be good. And it, everything I was seeing was shutting him down. And then I got nervous. Like, was it me? Am I being fucking, am I being a dick? Yeah. But then mm. him too, he just asked a question. He's like, hey, so you like uh, baseball? He's like, oh, so now we're going to make fun of baseball. Is that yeah. it? <laughs> and then he. God he, damn. Yeah. I didn't see it. Yeah. So I don't know. Yeah. You know what I mean? And the, yeah. the, f- the whole first 20 minutes is him shitting on Montreal and Quebec. It was amazing. How Quebec is the worst. The dumb. Quebecers are stupid and everything's horrible here. And then at the end, 
He, it's about how amazing Quebec is and how he's proud to be Quebecois, French Canadian. And so you're like, he what might be the, the best performer in Canada. What just happened? He knows how to take the it crowd was amazing, into the roller It was amazing. Yeah, amazing. it was amazing. For real, though, like all, uh, ever, all of the subscribers on Patreon, best episode they've ever seen in their lives. <laughs> and then when, when I'm going to put it out to everyone, I'm going to have to tell people, be nice. Like, yeah. just don't fucking just because uh, he's going to get so much fucking hate. But people might overdo the hate because a lot of the stuff that he was doing, yeah, he was shutting us down a bit, but we had fun with it. In the end, it's a memorable episode. It's an amazing episode. It's yeah. one of, like, uh, too, because uh, with, with this tour, I have uh, Anthony Amelin that, that's directing it, who's directed a bunch of specials. So the, the quality of the shows are like fucking Netflix or, yeah. or Prime or probably more Prime than Netflix. Well, I, but I think that... All three of us had some good zingers too. Yeah, we had but, a lot of but, bomb and, drops. And he told me he was like this. He was like he texted me yesterday. He was like, "This is by far the best episode that of the tour, and maybe even like one of the best episodes in the last three years." <laughs> so he, stupid. And everyone that that I know t that that that's like a super fan of Suzuki texted me, and they were like. I've watched the episode four times. Like, <laughs> people, because no, it's crazy. But yeah, people really like that yeah. shit. Like, people are still talking to me about <laughs> when I was with him, and it's like, yo, that episode. And I virtually didn't do anything in that episode because I couldn't yeah. talk. Yeah. But me and you I, virtually I, had I, the same I, position. I, I couldn't it talk. It was the same thing. He yeah. both he saw was, you as bullies. He was, he was, yeah, and I was trying my best because I didn't want him to feel the because was, I, yeah, he was blocking me off and he was like, Talking to, let's just say to Mike. You, say, you, you know, you know, you know, like, like I'm over here and making faces to the camera. Yeah. I couldn't talk. Yeah. With the new one, he wasn't saying to say to say. He was just going, "Let's go, let's go." <laughs> so whatever we'd say, we'd be like, uh, "Do you like uh, wh when you were uh, like wh other uh, either he'd be shutting us down or when he wasn't, we'd be like, "Hey, you were in Toronto. Let's go, let's go, Toronto. Okay, yeah. <laughs> so so how's Toronto? Let's go." <laughs> Fucking Toronto. Toronto's the best. Let's he's, go. He's the greatest yeah. performer in this country's history. Yeah. <laughs> this, but he couldn't perform because even the night yeah, before. He was amazing. Oh, wait, and I even said it because like Leo, for example, had never seen him. And he's like, oh, this Sebastian Burgood, he does it in English. Do you think he's going to do well? And me and Mike yeah. are like, he's going to get the he's biggest gonna pops. Murder. No. He's going to murder. This yeah. guy, this. You know what I when think? When we had our show, uh, the ethnic show, and he was on our show. Murder. Yo. He, he, what ethnicity Undeniable. yells "Let's go" every every three seconds? <laughs> Hi. <Yeah. laughs> yeah. You know what's fucked up though? I'm, I'm like I'm eighty percent sure he's gonna have a an amazing career in Toronto. Yeah. Because of the show we did uh, the night before the podcast. Because I was doing a place called the Great Hall, and uh, it was a uh, Pantelis and uh, Bogo was opening. Bogo was the first one on, and he was he was so good amazing. at doing like. He was a, a like a, a hype he was man. like a warm up guy like yeah. not not even a hype man he was like a warm up for a TV show it felt like I was I was oh, Steve yeah. Harvey doing Family Feud and he was just fucking getting them pumped I'll and do he pu no it, I know this from, guy is yeah. for incredible real, for real, and, and aside from the the, the podcast the and the is. the people from Live Nation that were there they were like this guy's fucking insane like he but insane in a good way they were like he's insane he's and then they were like imagine if we put him on stage before a band yeah and he'd fucking murder he and could, you could do a whole ass career all that Cause, yeah because as yeah. i but even as even as jokes like i remember I, the, the, the back in the days with the next show let's go let's go let's go <laughs> no, it feels weird to say that let's, let's go. go like this guy was but on he was on yeah always yeah, yeah. undeniable yeah. if you deny it you're just lying yeah because i see him you gotta respect the laugh yeah, yeah. I, I consistently see him yeah. murder yeah. not mm -hmm. do well murder. murder yeah yeah and on the podcast it was just so weird yeah he's not a, i yeah. realized he's, he's just not a, not a good podcaster guy. that's what it is that, and, and what was fucked up too? Like he does a podcast. It's fucking bizarre. And then we get off get off stage, and he was like, "That was amazing. We were so good." And I was like, "You were horrible. You were horrible. It, that was horrible." And he was like, "No, we had this fucking chemistry, well, f chemistry and a vibe and this complicity." And I was like, "What? No, like no, no, like." He know. I was like, "No." And that, my cousin asked, "Yeah, is he doing it on purpose?" And I'm yeah. like, "Nah, be." He, yeah. do, he does it. Shout outs to you, Nadine. 
Shout out, Navy. Yeah. Yeah, that's my. Girl. But it was fun. Toronto was was really really. Toronto's really a very. Fun. I gotta admit it, man. We're here on the podcast. We talk a lot of shit. Toronto's a yeah. real city. Yeah. Toronto is a real fucking. Because they have a baseball a real good team. City, and you're like a real. It's a city. It's a no, city. No, <laughs> it's, just, it's just like Montreal is, is seems tiny yeah. compared to Toronto. Yeah, definitely. Like Montreal is the biggest small city. Yeah. Like it's the Montreal biggest, is city. as big as you can get and remain a small city. Correct. Yeah. yeah. Like, the best description. Yeah. yeah. Toronto yeah. is feels fucking huge. Yeah. And Toronto's not not that much bigger. The, like Montreal, Greater Montreal is four million. Toronto's only like Greater Toronto's only six point seven. Which is only like one and a half times, but it feels as big as New York yeah, or and Chicago. That two, two millions more. It's like it's two million it's less than the whole fucking yeah, yeah. province. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It's all, yeah, it's true. No, but like like New Good York point. is greater. New York is twenty million, mm -hmm. and Toronto feels as big as New York. Yeah, or it even feels bigger. In New York because it's say so spread Dude, out. The, yeah, I the wouldn't spread say, out. I wouldn't say bigger. Though. The funniest thing that happened was because Leo has never been out of a village, right? Who? Uh, Leo. Uh, he's a vlogger that started coming around. He through. used he to be Yan's uh, kind of assistant. He's a vlogger. Try and then, then we, we, we're, we, he's just following us. He's never been anywhere. Never been we out in of, the suburbs. He, he lives at, at the Zistrant right now. Right. And uh, he, he loves it because he's like, uh, every, I have a dépanneur in my building. Mm -hmm. He's that type of kid. And uh, he, he, like, when we brought him to Moncton, he had never eaten Indian food. So first time he ate Indian food was in Moncton. Where's the guy from? And, and he's from, from Sherbrooke. And uh, th we brought him to a seafood restaurant. He was like, seafood, is this like a sushi? And we were like, no, no, it's seafood. He was like, yeah, like like sushi. They like uh, with uh, with fish and rice. And we're like, no. And it's he was like, fish. Isn't, isn't sushi seafood? And we we're like, no. And he was well, like, yeah, well, but technically, seafood kinda? is in sushi. Oh, yeah, yeah it's true. It's but, not. But we were sushi trying to not explain seafood. that to him, and then he didn't understand. And the funniest thing, we're we're in we're in Toronto, <laughs> and uh, before the podcast, and uh, we order Uber Eats, and uh, Pantelis orders uh, food for him and Leo, and he orders from a Greek place, and Leo films himself, and he goes, "I'm gonna uh, thanks to Pantelis, I'm gonna know about the Greek." Culture. I'm gonna finally eat Greek food. I've never eaten Greek food. I asked Pantelis what Have what you? did he order? <laughs> he's got a he's just got a sulaki. No, no, pita. not even. He got French fries. Oh yeah, sorry, sorry. You got all French he fries. had were French, French fries. fries, and yeah, then I gave him. I was like, the, the Greeks is fatter. It's yeah, no, but I was like, how can you say I'm I'm. I'm immersing myself in a new culture, yeah. and you've eaten fucking French fries. Yeah, then they're, I gave him the pita. Like these like, are French fries, and these are Greek French fries. Yeah, like they're thicker. Who? Why are you making fun cares? of my culture? Yeah, because I didn't Yo, immerse myself. Yo, we just myself. saying that the Greeks are thick, thick. Yo, Yo yeah. Greeks are thick, yeah. <laughs> super yeah. thick. Thick. Yeah, you got to You, you understand? Gotta say it like that. Uh, are you going to Toronto at all? We're gonna talk as if it is. If you want, if Man. I book my thing and I, we could go together, I have to book that. Dude, it's no, a beautiful room. Not, not now. We're gonna, oh. do that. We're gonna do that later. Such a good do, room, dude. We're gonna do Canada later. We're gonna probably finish the tour in Canada. <laughs> that makes sense for you. We'll see. You know I mean? really want to go, go back around, though. Go around the world. So, what are you guys doing? Like uh, you, last time we talked to you, you were you were starting with like uh, Pittsburgh, Pittsburgh, Philly, P Pittsburgh, Detroit, and uh, Washington. Nice. Okay. And those are the the three first the dates three first to dates see. To like, are we are we are we gonna be doing eight thousand seaters or, or well, yeah, two hundred seaters more, whatever? So, right now we're still gonna remain around the two hundred and two hundred to Played to to, to, to nine hundred seaters. That's a big fucking that's a huge yeah. room. Dude. That's, that's like a big saying, gap. I'm not saying my dick is between. I'm not saying my dick is between three and nineteen inches long. Oh, yeah, sexy. Congratulations. Yeah. <laughs> well, I mean, it's, it's just like the whole just, four inches. Gonna see, depending on the on, on the, the on the places, some places yeah. don't have little rooms. You know what I mean? Some people don't have rooms of of a hundred a hundred people or two hundred people. So and plus, go just go room. like that's the thing I noticed with Suze Good, like when when uh, for the Europe trip, like every person I flew out, you guys, you, you're not going to be flying out. Like yes, we are. eighteen people. Are no, you? no, we're not gonna fly it. No, but my yeah. bad, my but, bad. No, but like right. like every person I brought out, we, it was it cost me five G's per person to bring out. Yes. So like every show, like when we're doing like uh, if we're doing a thousand seater, I'm making a bit of money. But when like the, sh the shows that I'm doing, like in Toronto, it was a fucking 150 seater. So even if it's just me and Pantelis that flew out. 
That it, like I lost money on that yeah. show. But then again, the thing is, we're going to the states, so it costs less money to fly people in the states. We're not gonna be eighteen. Yeah, and not yeah. Gonna be right? in Brussels. We're not gonna be eighteen. It's probably gonna be like five of us. Yeah, but it, it it's five of us, and it doesn't it doesn't cuss as much. Yeah, you know what I mean. And on top of that, the fee that we charge is gonna be in US. Yeah. So let's say we charge thirty five bucks or forty bucks, and transfer yeah. that to the US. That's fine. That's that's on two hundred seats. Yeah, starts that's adding up. Good. Yeah, you know what I mean. So. Yeah, we're, we don't. We're not gonna spend as much as you are because we have less people, and on top, like we're not filming. Like we're filming it, but like stand up crew. Yeah. Right? So it's two people. It's not a podcast. We're yeah. Not rebroadcast. Yeah, I thing. fucking I brought a goddamn crew. Yeah, yeah. like my like a a film crew. My Europe, my Europe thing cost me a uh, hundred thousand euro. Absolutely. For four shows, a hundred goddamn thousand euro, which That's is a hundred and fifty thousand Canadian. Yep. I could I could have fucking flew. A like sp- it's good that you have the fans that you have to be able to do that. Goddamn. Because. That's a whole ass lot of money. Yeah, that's a life. whole production. Yeah, that's a whole fucking production. If I had kids, they would all have crazy crooked teeth. Because <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> yes. like, daddy wanted to go to Europe. Daddy wanted to go to Europe, <laughs> but that that yeah. It, but at the same time, like you do. <laughs> I was talking to Eddie King, and <laughs> this motherfucker was talking to me about you. He was talking about us three, and he was like, "You guys do shit. You, know, you do what you want." Just because you want to do it, or it's a good, because it a seems good, fun. It's a good. It's a funny thing to do. Yeah, yeah. like Which yeah, is the best that's, way that's to the live. Mike mentality. Yeah. yeah. Why did you? Why did? Why did you? Why did you order a jet and start bone gag? It's that was yeah. the answer that I got. What do you want me to do? It's a good. To- it's a good story to tell later. Yeah. Why yeah. did you do it? Cause I can and it's fun. Yeah, Mike yeah. said something like that. He said at one point, "This can be a good story." This I'm upset right now, but this can be a good thing. <laughs> I heard you say that, so it's really it's really funny. But 150000 that's a lot. That was expensive. That's a, but I didn't pay all of it. The Montreux uh, Comedy Festival people paid like 100,000 euro, and I think they paid like 60,000 euro. So it only cost me 40,000 euro. Still. That's yeah, absurd. which is a crazy expensive. Still. Yeah. It's a lot of money. Yeah. If you... Think yeah. about it, but then again, you make a lot of money and you give you give back, so that's good. It's yeah. like like a small times Mr. Beast. Yeah, I'm a, I'm a small times Mr. Beast. You're instead Mr. Of, you're instead, Mr. Bo- you're Mr. Monster. You're Mr. Instead Monster. Instead of curing a blindness, I'm uh, I'm making fun of blind yeah. people. Yeah. <laughs> small steps. Yeah, yeah. Right? I don't, I don't <laughs> cure blindness. I have been the cause of mental retardation. <laughs> so, yeah, I think it's a good thing that you do that. And you're able to like to give back to your fans, like it's yeah. You don't have no. to, why would you go to France? No, yeah, you don't exactly. have to. You can do the same goddamn thing yeah. from here, yeah. and it doesn't change a goddamn thing. Yeah, I, I noticed in Toronto how how grateful they were. They were so happy to see us. Nobody yeah. from nobody Canadian go. Nobody, nobody Canadian. Nobody Canadian nobody, nobody goes Canadian. to Toronto. Nobody French. <laughs> exactly. <Canadian>. Exactly. <laughs> nobody that's French Canadian goes there for yeah. the French Canadian out there. Mm. When we think French, it's only Quebec yeah. and that's yeah. it. We don't think about we don't think about northern northern Ontario. We don't think about the Maritimes. So people when Alberta. every time every time she Hi. Anyways, <laughs> people with no beer. <laughs> I only think about the Aboriginals. I think about them. Absolutely. You do absolutely nothing, I but think you think about, about them. them. I yeah. think about them. Sometimes I giggle. Yeah, <laughs> but I think. <laughs> but that's a good thing. I think it's a good thing that you do that. Man. Yeah. That's no, fun. it was fun. Like Super the fun. the yeah, uh, all of the show. This is how crazy though. Like we the first night we we're doing stand up in yeah. English, and it was kind of a test because Live Nation wanted to see how I'd sell, and I wanted to see if I liked working with Live Nation. Right. And they their standards are so fucking low. Because we only sold like 200, 200 tickets. And I was like, okay, so fuck it. We're, we're not going to, I'm not going to come back. And they were like, this is amazing. We didn't lose money. That was there. Yeah, that was there. They, they were like, we didn't lose money. It's incredible. We have a Canadian act that doesn't lose money. Yeah. And they, I was like, how they, shitty of a country they, are we? Did they know who, who you were? Yeah. Yeah, they did. They, know, they knew you yeah. or they heard? No, they knew, knew. Okay. Like, uh, I met what the guy, the guy from Live Nation. I realized, like, what when we were talking, because he he was like, "Hey, I, I, like," and I saw I saw that he knew me. Like, you know, when you meet someone and you know well, that you've talked here. to him. So yeah, he's a guy who used to be in Montreal. He's like, "Hey, man, it's been a long time," and I was like, "Yeah, it's been forever," because I was sure I met him 
like in the fucking nineties. And he was like, yeah, I, I saw you last year. And I was like, yeah, yeah, it's been a long time, like a year. It's super long. <laughs> and you didn't know. I didn't know, but I knew I could tell. I could tell that we had talked yeah. by the way he was yeah, saying, yeah, "Hey, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, that always freaks me out because yeah. people that don't know talk to me like that. Hey, what's up, man? And I'm like trying. Do to I know them out. or they? What the me? fuck do I? And then like fucking five minutes into the conversation, I'm like, I don't know this bitch. Yeah, <laughs> it ever happens that you play along. Until you get the memory, and then you're like, yeah. "Oh, that's where I know them from." And then you're like, yeah. "Okay, now I'm in." Yeah, 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 yeah I'll just play along until I figure it out. I'm like, "Oh, but yeah." But sometimes yeah. I was just like, "Wait, where? From where?" Yeah, because that's the best way I think to handle wait, it. Wait, from where? Because you them? have so many people that pretend like, mm. "Hey, man, do you remember me?" And you're like, "Yeah," but and they're like, "Ah, we've never met." And you're like, "Oh, you fucking asshole!" Ah, well, we. Yeah. I'm never gonna forget. Yeah, that. I know. I remember that we never met. Mm. <laughs> Fuck out of my face, <laughs> but but yeah, I, I I it's better to go like straight up and be like, yeah, tell the truth. Yeah, where that's my purse, just, just from where, and then they're gonna tell. Oh, we don't, we, I've never met. Yeah. Cool, carry on. Yeah. Where do I know you from? Fuck I know me. you from this. Oh, okay, cool. Carry on, homie. I watch you on the YouTube's. You hard, b. Yeah. <laughs> Why you so hard? You hard, man. I fuck with you heavy. You fuck with me heavy. Yeah. Anyways, that's a weird thing yeah. that people say. People say some weird shit. People say some weird shit. Yo, yeah. how's the how's the internet beefs? You still beefing? Uh, we're not beefing. We're not beefing. We just say some stuff and we laugh it off. We're not beefing. They're beefing with us. Be- people are beef- beefing with us, but no, it's not. We just call people out, and that's it. And we get called out too. It's yeah. just that we don't take it personal. Well, it's not. It's just. But right now, there's nothing. There's nothing really. Oh, it's slow. It's just a girl named Just Smelly Things. Oh, her just smelly things. Just manly things. Oh, just just uh, smelly things. That's uh, a good one. Her real name is just pearly. Just just smelly things. things. It's a podcast about her vagina. She she, she just. She just. (sighs) Grifter. Yes, grifter. That's a good word. She's a grifter. She's grifting. She's, she's what, what? 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 What's her beef? She's a. She's a blue. She's not a beef. It's just a blue pill girl. Yeah. And just just regurgitating everything that the blue pill community says without making any sense of it. And she believes that black them. people should not have the right to vote. That's not what she said. No, that's just me. That's just me. Sorry. Okay. That's I was, just I, was, I, was, I was mixing it up. You're stupid. You're <laughs> with my stupid. manifesto. I'm so You're sorry. Stupid. Is she a black no, chick or no, a white no, chick? No, no, okay. no. Yeah, this is black. I was just She's not white. Okay. She's not okay. white. She's pale. Okay. Yeah, she, it's like it's She's like a, a logo. Skin? Oh, mine and your names? It's like that. There, it's her. Okay. Poor girl. Her views are plummeting. Poor girl. Really? She's losing views because of all this? Because she... So wait, so Gri- uh, I, I've heard her say some stupid, this is the stupid shit that I've heard her say. I've heard her say like, you know, sh- she'll talk like as if there's a guy at a bar sometimes. She'll be like, yeah. man, think about women is, you gotta get your shit together. And it's like, what the fuck are you talking about? Like she's shit like that. She's like, she's like, like, women past 25 are past their prime and they're not good. Finally, like, someone. Yeah, finally, <laughs> someone. said it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> then she says, People want a girl that people want a girl that you know she's docile and is not on the forefront and always I'm talking. Subscribing right she now. Wants, this is she my she kind says of lady. you know uh, people like women like if you're not a virgin you're not worth that bitch is not a virgin. If she's you're not a virgin, she's 26 years old. Okay? Who wants a 26 year old virgin? Muslims. No. <laughs> <laughs> For real. Imagine imagine like meeting a chick Jeez. that's 26 that's never been with a cock like you're like you don't know what dude, the uh, fuck cock. you're doing just a cock yeah Come on, lesbians yeah unless unless she's the type of virgin that's like sucking dick and everyone, Taking the ass. everyone's fucking yeah, her in the calling, ass yeah, i'm a yeah. bad virgin you're like every time i fuck my new wife my virgin wife in the pussy shit because <laughs> her asshole doesn't close anymore <laughs> i think it's a medical condition <laughs> yeah it's called three guys fucking <laughs> oh, the same yeah. uh, now i got the image <laughs> shit. Stuck in my head. i knew a girl <laughs> like yeah. that it Every fucking away. poop just squirts. Oh, <laughs> you, have squir- you have diarrhea. Shit no. squirting on your balls. Every oh. fucking pump. Jesus fucking Christ, my guy. <laughs> so, twenty-six year old virgins. Yeah, so a lot anyways, of- whatever. It, but it's not a beef. It's just, it's just whatever. So I have no beefs. It's just we're just doing this, man. Wait, is she the one talking shit? Wasn't it the black guy on that show that was talking shit? She was part of the that old show, guy. but then they, 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 they all turn on her because. <gasps> She invited at some point Nick Fuentes, which is a huge. Wait white, a second, white. Nick Fuentes, the Spanish named white supremacist. Yes, that guy's. That guy's. There's a Spanish named white supremacist. Yes. Nick Fuentes. 
Nick and, Fuentes? And, 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 yeah, yeah. And, and but she, he'll argue he's not a white supremacist. He's a white enthusiast. Okay. Yes. But he, he, yeah, she invited him and he was saying some outlandish shit. Like? She about you guys? About, no, about no, black people. No, he's not and she didn't dispute none yeah, of that. Yeah, that. that's what I meant when I said you guys. You people. <laughs> <laughs> what was she saying about you people? <laughs> <laughs> Yo. <laughs> what did she say though? For real, what did he say? Oh, man. That, that, I think she said something about black, black people being... Not as smart or whatever, whatnot. Some outlandish shit. And he's like, yes. Holler, Holler crew was like, "You're not gonna defend." Like, we oh, he said, "Like, we're not smart." And she's like, "And she's like, you're making you great points. Go, Carry go, go, on." Continue. Well, I can understand how you know. I can understand how slavery was really embellished. I'm like, what embellished. Oh, what a dumb bitch. What are you saying, my girl? And then she didn't say. She didn't say nothing about that. She didn't push back on it. She's like, yeah, but then she just went. Mah, 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 it's like that's a good point. You don't like getting fed. You don't nah, like I'm having like, a place I'm to like, stay. Oh and my days. But but is the that whole show? people that the, the people that she the, the, the other podcast that she's on all, all them. They're black. Is that show ever live, though? So, like, if... if Because that's the type of thing that she could have been, like... You know that, that, that show I did with the guy that was talking shit about black people? And I was just Remember saying, he said go, on, go on, go <laughs> on. Bravo, bravo, good man. Maybe, maybe we should cut that. Remember when he said slavery was cool? Can you cut me cheering? Yeah. Or, <laughs> you have to keep that Can in you there? cut me going, let's go. Let's go. <laughs> let's go. But none of that was done. So, yeah, people are, yeah, oh, people no. are not. They're just like, God Ugh. damn. She's a dumb bitch. I'm kind of liking her now. This is ridiculous. You, there's a level of stupidity that I started oh, appreciating. She's so stupid. <laughs> it's not her fault. Not a stupid. Bitch. It is. But so they. So she brought a white, super, a white enthusiast on to talk just about race stuff, different kind of stuff, and yeah, it, it, like she was not pushing back on none of that, and yeah, people started. People are starting to call her out on her shit. Even she was on Pierce. Oh, uh, Pierce uh, Morgan. Uh, Pierce Morgan. I was gonna say Pierce Brosnan. She, she was. She was on on Pierce's show. She was on Pierce's show. And did Pierce, he? There was another like super feminist girl uh, that was there. She was saying some outlandish shit so much that Pierce didn't say nothing. Didn't, he didn't say nothing. He was like, at some point he started the They're camera all nuts. like, ooh, these bitches are going at it. I'm oh, they're going at it? I'm not going to interject. For Pierce not to interject, mm. that shit You're both dumb. dumb. Mm. Yeah. Holy shit. I, I'm, I still have a stare in my head that I'm laughing at. Is her asking the guy? So you're saying black people are stupid. And he's like, yes. He's like, huh, I thought you had controversial opinions. <laughs> and then the, the editor's yeah. like, sure, oh you won't keep that in there. <laughs> this oh is crazy. Boy. This oh is batshit crazy. <laughs> like for Pierce to make sense. You made Pierce make sense. Well, because Pierce was shutting up. But anyways. You know how bad you have to be to, to lose subscribers on YouTube? Yeah. Like I've, there are people that you 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 stop watching their videos. But to actually unsubscribe. You have to hate that person. Yes. But she turned hateable. Her own crew turned yeah. against her. She's never. But I, th I don't think like she's losing subscribers. I think like the views. Okay. For the number of subscribers that she has, I'm like the views are the latest views are not that great. Do you think it's because the videos people are like I'm tired of hearing about how women are stupid or whatever she does? I don't know what it is. Because sometimes you I don't get know. tired of that. I think the I think the people that are that at some point some some people they have views like that and stuff like that. They have a lot of uh, they have a lot of. Uh, I'm gonna cut. Of, uh, I wasn't uh, drinking, but because I I drank a lot tonight, so. But bad. I had two waters. Uh, <laughs> Balance. Two small, two small waters. I'm good. I'm good. Like they're just watching you for entertainment. Hate watch. They're not even. Yeah. They're just not even here. What is this dumb motherfucker gonna say? The same way we were watching. We was watching Jerry Springer. Oh, that was good. I was like, yeah. what are these dumb fucking underappreciated? Yeah, underappreciated. Jerry Springer. That, that motherfucker died? Or was it yeah, he died. No, uh, Jerry Springer's not dead. No, he died a few months ago. Yeah, I did thought he? Yeah. Oh, yeah, shit. Yeah, I think he died. Yeah. God damn it. That was one of the oh, saddest days of the calendar yeah. year. Fuck. Yeah. I feel bad for him. Yeah, I feel bad for April 27th. Yeah, there you go. What did he die of? Uh, oh, I fun. think AIDS. Cause of death. Uh, pancreatic cancer. Okay, that's bad. Oh, that's not as funny as I was hoping. <laughs> <laughs> you know it was going to be? I was hoping. A guy threw a chair in his yeah, head. I was hoping something hilarious, <laughs> like a fucking, some hillbilly. He got in between two transsexuals fighting and he yeah. was murdered. Yeah, he was the best. He was the mayor of Cincinnati and he, he stopped being mayor because he paid for a prostitute with a check. Yeah. I love this guy. Yeah. <laughs> that, like, 
There are many ways to there pay for There are many whores. ways to, especially in the 70s or whatever it was. <laughs> like that everyone paid cash for everything. Uh, People used to buy cars with cash, and he was like, let me get my checkbook, <laughs> whore. <laughs> <laughs> Do I pay it out to you or to your pimp? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> So it is Mr. Dolomite? Yeah. <laughs> he wrote it to Shaft. <laughs> but Jesus Christ, that's what happened. But then that people liked him because of that. He became, that's yeah. how he got the show. Because people were like, you know what? Yeah. There's something about that. Like, he was just so honest. He's like, I bang hookers. Sometimes I got to bang hookers with, with city funds. Yeah. <laughs> and people were like, you know what? I like and that. the hillbillies on that show were so good. Yeah. You can't be a white supremacist if you've ever seen an episode of Jerry Springer. No, you're like, ah. You're, you're like, so oh, our you're race. Like, That's <laughs> our people. Yeah. Whoa. yeah. If you look, this is a funny thing you bring up. If you look at every single country, you look at any race you want, but you actually look deep, you're like, there's no supreme race. If you look at Jerry Springer, there's none. There's none. There's yeah. no supreme there's, race. There's, everybody was like, oh, my God. There's supreme animals. Yeah. I believe it's the dogs because they're the nicest. The dogs are nice. Octopus seem smart. Dolphins, yeah. Octopus monkeys, smart. ape creatures are probably on the top there, but we're bottom. We don't um, we don't fit in. We're dicks. We need clothes all the time. I'm we, not we, sure we, octopus are that nice. Though. I didn't like, say nice. They said yeah. they're smart. They're yeah, very they're smart. smart. No, they, they're found. And monkeys. They, 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 monkeys they, they, don't seem that nice. They're not nice either, but they're fucking been, they've funky been found monkeys. to yeah. punch fishes for no reason. That's yeah. funny as fuck. That's funny as fuck. Dolphins? Yeah. No. Octopus. Octopus. Oh, oh no way. Eight fucking... They eight punch you eight times, just, bro. Yeah. They, they do that pop, 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 pop. There's videos of just uh, octopus randomly punching... A, <laughs> randomly That's punching... So funny. That's fucking funny. amazing. Yeah. That's funny. Yeah, dolphins are smart. Yeah. 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 Just, dogs are the best, though. No, they're not. Just, just the, the first, the the first Yo, search... Did my dog did an operation yesterday. They took out, like, from her remaining teeth whatever was left because you know she had problems with, with the teeth so they had to sedate her and I was all fucking super nervous because like you know just so you know whenever we sedate animals like she's old as fuck too. yeah well, they, when they go to sleep they might not wake up that's the scariest fucking thing yeah. to tell someone like me yeah yeah. yeah I, I was panicking a dog sim. yeah but now you, you would have killed the person to to tell you I oh, look I, uh, your dog ac accidentally yeah. died well, you would murder that person well they, they they didn't call me when they were supposed to and it was like an hour later and I was like this is impossible and I freaked out so much that I called and it's like ooh uh, yeah give me a second and I was like if they tell me that my dog died I'm going I'm, I'm gonna go fucking kill everyone in there and then she's like, no, no, she's awake. She's in good spirits. She's high as fuck, you know? I was like, oh, thank God, because I was going to murder everyone. Uh, so then I went, I went to get her, and now she's like, she has one tooth here. She looks ridiculous. Her tongue's fucking hanging out. But uh, fucking little, she's high, Why but in good spirits. Because remember the way I got her? She was all fucked up. She was, uh, when I first adopted her, she was neglected. So she her was teeth a battered dog. Were, even though I cleared her teeth, her teeth were fucked up from seven years of neglect. So now they were, like, they were dying in the back. They were getting infected. So it's not good to have an infection in your mouth. It goes no. to her belly. It's not good for her kidneys. Yeah, yeah. So I had to risk it. I said, I feel like she's strong enough. Let me take the teeth out now so that her health gets better. Give her more time to live. You uh, know? She would she just eat much food. Yeah. No, yeah, but the thing is, I, I never got her dog food anyway. I cook for her. Like, uh, and she's she good she now, though? Cook she has, for she, your she, dog? Yeah, dude, she yeah. eats sheets. Let's go. Let's go. She eats salmon. <laughs> she eats chicken. She eats you well. cook for yeah. your dog? Yeah. yeah, he cooks, and he cooks different meals every <laughs> fucking meal so that the dog doesn't go, oh, fucking chicken again. Yeah, dude, my dog drinks bottled water. Yeah. Man, we're not the same. I cook for my dog. You cook for your dog. Yeah, you know why? Because of the way I got her. Dude, she had like the worst, the worst that fucking life. That has got to be the whitest I feel shit terrible. <laughs> I don't think it's the whitest. His dog's life is our episode with Bogo. Started out as garbage, mm. ended amazing. Yeah. yeah. Be, I feel terrible. Every time I look at her, I think about that, like the, the, the beatings and all that stuff. And I was like, ah, fuck. I don't know how much time she has left. Because you have to remember when I first got her, they told me, she has about a year to live. So I said, yo, this is going to be the best fucking year ever. And now... That was in 2017. And, yeah, yeah. I did too good. I did too yeah. good, bro. <laughs> you could, that's a bit much. Cooking for your dog. Yeah. But, that's amazing. Though. But it made her healthy yeah. as fuck. Yeah, but you're, like the, same, dog food, you're the same as him. Because yeah, dog food's yeah. garbage, bro. Dog yeah. food's like worse than hot dogs. I never, I never tasted dog food, so I wouldn't know. Okay, listen. Listen, if you're going to be one of my dogs... We're going to have to eat dog food together. We're going to have to eat cans of dog food together so we're road dogs. This is where this friendship ends. Come on. <laughs> uh, no, do but dog food, I know uh, from how they make it. They make it just like hot dogs and even worse, it's all shitty stuff. It's like it's feeding your kid McDonald's. Dog, food. they lick their ass. Mm. They can lick their ass, but if you want them to stay healthy, you need vitamin. There's no nutrients in that shit. And to be, to be fair, if you were flexible, you you'd did probably your do the same. 
not for nutriment factors. No, no, definitely, no, exactly. not. definitely no, no. not. I hope not. <laughs> just fucking. You're like, I'm lacking protein. Yeah. Let me suck my dick. No, yeah. bro, no. Why are you to... sucking your dick? I'm hungry. Yeah, I'm hungry. <laughs> <laughs> no, bro. I had a light lunch. <laughs> I'm on this diet. <laughs> yeah, so it just became a habit because we thought she's not going to survive a year and then she's got more and more progressively yeah, healthier. Yeah, she just You walk in a room, you said, dude, yeah. sucking his own dick. What are you doing? I'm, yeah. on, I'm on a cleanse. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> what, are you, what are you doing? I'm on Atkins. <laughs> My dick is Atkins. <laughs> this yeah. is intermittent fasting. <laughs> it's inter- as opposed to intermittent yeah. fisting. <laughs> I'm doing intermittent fisting. <laughs> so Toronto, I did like. We're going to be honest. Yeah. I did like Toronto. Toronto. This was amazing. is awful. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. From fisting to Toronto. Oh, we're getting to fisting. <laughs> yeah. I, I did like Toronto. A lot yeah. of crackheads. A lot of, but like any big city, there's a lot mm-hmm. of crackheads. Yeah, it's just more we had More an amazing house again. Amazing house yeah. again. Basically, the mansion life. The basically, yeah, it was Atlanta. Yeah. That was it. Atlanta. Yeah, 2. it was 0. nice. Um, was there a, uh, a house in the back? There was uh, well, Atlanta, I think, was Just better because the house one, in the back. Yeah. At, well, Atlanta was a little nicer. The rooms were the same, but Atlanta, the outside was nice. Mm. Toronto, the outside was fucking the garbage. Crazy. So it looked like a shithole. And then you went inside and you were like, God damn it. Mm. Yeah. Like, it was just, it was a rich person house that the rich person didn't want the crackheads to steal. Yeah. Mm. So it looked shitty from the outside. It was so, a fat chick with a good personality. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what? It was a fat chick. Fat chick with a good personality. That's what it was. You thought you were like this fatty and then you're like, oh, this is awesome. I put it tight. She's amazing. Um... What's the next fight that we're going to see? Uh, we're t- I, I bought tickets for uh, Olivier on the 23rd. Okay. Remember, remember remember, when we went where a GSP was sitting? Yeah. That I bought eight tickets. That's what's up. Front row, right on the side. That's what's up. Yeah. Who's going like to Like a dummy that fucking spends $150,000 per trip to Europe. I mean, I spent... Never mind. Um, you. So we're going to be there on the 23rd? Yeah, 23rd. Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna be uh, like doing an in and out between the 19 and oh, the 26. Oh yeah, true. Well, that's fine. Oh, yeah. That's fine. So I'm gonna go with 23rd there. We're gonna have fun. Yeah. No, well, gonna, what's on going? the night? Uh, no one yet. Like uh, I just bought the tickets and didn't tell anyone yet. I knew. Oh, you told yeah. me. I told you and I told him. So you didn't take. Top but <laughs> don't tell <laughs> this guy. <laughs> <laughs> so there's five people left. Spot five spots left. Yeah, I've I've my girl coming with me because she likes violence. No now. shit. Yeah, yeah. She likes violence because what you? No, my it, fucking shows are violence yeah. all the time. No, because she she used to really like boxing, mm-hmm. and she saw uh, UFC and PFL as being like barbarians. And then I was telling her, I was like, fucking boxing, they get hit in the face and they're borderline fucking brain dead, and they don't stop the fight. Whereas fucking MMA. As soon it gets violent so quickly that they stop it right away. And so they get suspensions dangerous. after people yeah. don't understand this. After after an MMA fight, they get suspended. People think it's because they did something wrong. It's not no. The, the medic is gonna check you and he's gonna suspend yeah. your ass for six months. Like you're not you're not gonna sign like in another three months. Yeah. Your fucking ribs are broken. Yeah. So you're suspended. Yeah. And you're gonna see me again, see how that di- that is, and I can prolong you I can prolong your, your suspension. When they suspend someone after a match it's because they're broken. Yeah. So they actually take care a little bit more. Yeah, of way, people, more. Way, more boxes, way more. Health you know? Way more. Health wise way more. And see like the PFL to one Monetary thing wise, they do that the that's better than the UFC since they know they gotta fight in another three months. Fighters are very res- respectful. Yeah. So when th- when they they're beating a guy and they know he's down, they won't punch no. him like two extra times no. to hurt him. Just to make like sure. they might do in the UFC. Yeah. They're like, okay, I beat this guy, it's over. And she really liked that. Like when we went to see, it was UFC we went to see, but a guy get knocked down, they stop her right away. Like after one fight, she was like, oh, I fucking love this. And it was funny because she was talking to her mom before the fight. And uh, she's doing like a FaceTime thing. And I heard her mom say, she was like, look, if you're not comfortable, uh, you can leave during the fight. Because she thought like I was like this fucking like a thug going, come on, bitch. We're going to watch these men fight. And she was like, you can leave. You don't have to stay for the violence. And I've met your girl. She could fuck you up. 
No, yeah, probably. And then the <laughs> next day, <laughs> yeah, probably. The next day, like she called, and she was like, "It was amazing. It was amazing." Yes, I'm gonna bring her down. Just breaking news: Usada is gonna be in the PFL. I saw that. I love that they used the photo of Oli. Yeah, that's what he said. Like am we're I, testing yeah. him. He's like, am I? Am I? Am I just the face of PFL or, or Peds? Yeah, <laughs> he wrote that shit. And and I asked him. I asked him if it was a good thing, and he said, "Yeah." Because when we went to see the PFL. I was under the impression that a couple of them guys were juiced. Yeah. Juiced. And actually, 11 guys. I think guys some of them might have been gay, too. <laughs> but I only say this because Poseidon was sucking one of their dicks. Right. But I don't know. I, it's new <laughs> age. But, I don't know. It's a weird at decision. at the end of the day, Poseidon needed protein. Yeah, there no, he's not the gay one. He's out there performing a fucking no. service. Yes. He's servicing these men. And just getting protein. Mm. Oh okay. So besides, yeah, you're doing I was getting, I was getting the drugs out their dick. Yeah, that's right. Through besides, their dick. How did it taste though? <laughs> Do you think they were on drugs? Um, very acidic. Okay. Drugs. Uh, that's drugs. That's definitely drugs. Too much testosterone. Good job, by the way. I don't like the way you saw this testing. Last, Suspicious. Last card. <laughs> last card. The last fight that they just had right now. I mean. Yo, Eleven guys. Oh, and, and you Nick, saw fucking Tyson Nganu Fury and, Fury. and, one, and uh, one, yeah, in and, Abu Dhabi. Uh, in, in, in no, one, no, in uh, in uh, Saudi, Saudi Arabia. Arabia. Yeah, like at first I was like, I'm buying tickets, and then I was like, so I am not, not going a, to Saudi it's, Arabia. It's Oof. a scam. Ain't shit. It's an exhibition. You think? Huh? It's an exhibition. Yeah. Just yeah. like every time that floor Mayweather was fighting mm. whoever the fuck in Japan was and shit. Yeah, because it's like it's, it's a scam. I think it's for it's money. It's a scam. Oh yeah, yeah. Of it's course. a scam. It's no, no, because I mean Nagano is gonna fight in the PFL. Just signed. He's not that gonna. Was, that was PFL. That's it, it PFL. is. It is a PFL, it's PFL. promoting it's a PFL. It. What? It's a it's PFL, a PFL, PFL fight. Oh, because I was thinking the PFL would not risk. Because I no, honestly believe in a regular boxing match, the guy that has experience would probably. No, beat he's him. got Tyson. Tyson Fury is could fuck Francis and Ganu up so hard because they're two different sports. Yeah, that's it's what I'm like, saying. It's like like comparing uh, Will Ferrell with uh, with Dave Chappelle. Yeah, like Will Ferrell is fucking hilarious in a movie. Will Ferrell is way funnier. Than Dave Chappelle in a movie, but in stand up, but put him on stage. Will Ferrell sucks dick. Chappelle yeah. runs circles. Yeah. yeah, exactly. So this isn't like if they were fighting MMA and Ganu would fuck him up. Even yeah. kickboxing, and he'd fuck him up. But regular boxing, he has saying. no chance. But that's why it shocked me. Why would you? And they're risk, both the same age. Why would you risk a, a star that you just signed? Why would you risk his he reputation? He left UFC because of money. Mm. You he think just, him fighting in fucking uh, Saudi Arabia is not going to be money? Oh, that's crazy. bank. That's money. That's Royal more, money. That's more money that he could ever make in, in his whole career yeah. in UFC. Yeah, you're right. Just, just that fight. Because he just signed with he PFL. Gets, yeah. If he gets, yeah. yeah, he signed with PFL. Just if he gets a percentage He's of gonna the pay per view, at least fifty million. Off Forget that, fight. that. He could never make that in yeah. his whole career of UFC. Yeah. Why do you think? Did you see the 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 white South African? Uh, I think yeah, I, th I that he was him. saying I'm I'm the I'm the f I'm gonna be the only real African champion, because oh. all of, all of the UFC guys that are African live in like uh, 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 Adesanya lives in uh, New Zealand and uh, uh, oh yeah, yeah. Usman, Usman yeah. yeah but you know what uh, then I agree with the South African he's right he would be the only African that's but really it was in funny because like he was saying I'm I'm the first African I'm the only real African. And then uh, they called him out, and he was like, "I never said that. I never said that." Oh, and really? then you see him going, "I'm the only true African." <laughs> he might be in that context. The fact that he lives in Africa still, yeah. but the the Africans that they have in the UFC are are killers. Like, yeah. if, who's he gonna beat? He's not gonna beat. He's anyone. supposed to go against Adesanya. Adesanya is yeah. insane, bro. And Adesanya is so funny because he he he's like, I dream about punching him and just calling him the N word oh, as that's I hit so him. Funny. <laughs> and he's gonna do it. Yeah, Adesanya's and the crazy. guy he was with was like, you're gonna and when you hit him, you should say, and you want to be one of us. <laughs> that's amazing. I, and I think he's gonna yeah. do exactly yeah. that. But what if it's he loses? Gonna be like he's gonna lose, and then another one buys the dust. On to the next one. Uh. I mean, you win some, you lose some, whatever. That's oh, and uh, uh, this is total change of subject. But um, uh, what wh what's that guy's name? Uh, the the actor, uh, the, uh, the yes, guy, the only one. No, the 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 actor from um from uh, the, uh, the fuck black white. No, um, f the fat guy. 
uh, with the curly hair. Uh, oh, Jonah Hill. Jonah Hill. God damn. Oh yeah. Yeah, I drank too much. Jonah Hill. Uh, you saw you saw what happened. Yeah, we did a video on that. Okay, I'm not too sure about what happened. We did a video on that. So what happened was his girl, like the way Abba knows about this. This stuff, is his right? ex girlfriend right now. He so just had a ex, baby. Peep, peep, peep game. So Abba shows me the video where or the thing where. You know, Jonah Hill's ex was like, yeah, he's abusive, he's abusive, he's abusive. And then I was like, oh, all right, cool. I read the text. And I'm like, he was setting his boundaries, but that's not abusive. He's saying, I like this, I don't like that, I don't like that, I don't like that, and I'm not going to have that. Mm. That's boundaries. If you don't like that, get. Yeah, You're not kinda... bound by this relationship. If you don't like that, get the fuck out. I only now, have one problem that, with that whole that, text. That, 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 being said, yeah. that being said, I thought this was recent. No, they used to was, go out yeah. like three years yeah, ago, this bitch and I'm like, why are you? For three why years. are you? There you go. Yeah. Pulling that story out now when he moved on, and he just had he a, baby. Has a whole ass baby, and then, yeah. well, I waited after the baby just so that the mother's not. Yeah, under she yeah. said I didn't want to hurt. I didn't want to hurt the mother. I okay, so the mother when she just delivered, finding out that her husband. Her, her boyfriend, the, her baby daddy, is a piece of garbage. That's good. But he's not. He's not. No. I have one problem with the text, though, that what? I didn't understand. The first thing says you you shouldn't be, like, you can't surf with men or something like that. But yeah, I don't understand mental. surfing. Surfing, aren't you alone on a surfboard? No one shares a surfboard. Bro. No, no, no. I just no, don't no, understand you, that. You, you no, know you're what surfing that means? with other men. You're, you know you're, what that means, though? Around. You, you can't like, control who the fuck's in the water. Like, like what, when, when you read the text message, like, the whole thing, he seems crazy. You're like, go fuck yourself. She's a surfer. Of course she's, she's going to have bathing pictures suit. in a bathing suit. Yeah. Of course she's going to surf Absolutely. with other dudes. But for him to write that, that means that she banged a surfer. Well, because he said something in the text. Like, if, if these are people of, from your past that they... That's had, a type mm. of thing a guy that got cheated on would yeah. write. Which, which is fine. Like, I don't care. Even if his things are <clears throat> out of the... Like, it makes no sense. Uh, every night, I want you to make bread. He's just saying what he likes. Yeah. yeah if you don't like you it, say leave. no, and you get... I want shawarma every morning. And he's being he's being controlling. No, he's being controlling if he forces you to stay there and he's telling you do those That's things. What I those said. Things. Yeah. That's a different thing. Where he's just you saying, don't want him to I don't have this and that yeah. and that, and I'm not gonna have that. And Would you, you leave and you're good. You already done left with the dude. Yeah. yeah. So I I fail to see what's really abusive yeah. with that. It's funny. There's how no abuse. This no, is no, they no were saying abuse. that she was. She, well, she's uh. she's saying no to that, and she's setting her brown boundaries. That's what dude is doing. Yeah. yeah. And even, he, even, he even says at some point in the text, like, yo, if you don't like it, it's cool. You could leave. Like, he wasn't forcing yeah, yeah. you to, to stay with so him. So I'm like, yo, what's the big thing with that? Yeah. People really like to, like, oh, well, yeah, he was in a position of power. They love to use that Other shit. position of position power, power thing. That, yo, Go fuck yourself. People in not whatever. Go not, fuck I'm yourself. not gonna get into that, but, but yeah, I saw all that to say. Yeah, I saw what happened. Are you, are you guys uh, uh, jealous? Like, if if your girl was there, because here's the thing: whenever I read shit like that of a guy the to defend the girl, whenever I see a guy going, don't don't wear a bathing suit. Uh, but you met her and you knew that she was a surfer. Both yeah. both sides are goobers. Are, they're both mental. They're they're both goobers. Yeah. What you're asking, what you're demanding, is stupid. I don't think it's abuse. But I think, yeah, I think it's stupid. I don't want you to take, eh. Why are you dressed like but, a but, whore? But, but, but it's fine. You, look at him looking at pictures of her. Would you? No, no, no. no. Would you, I'm, I'm, I'm paying sign, attention to the would, program. Like if your girl was a surfer, would no. you let her dress like that? I mean, yeah. There's not, I, I'm looking at her pictures. That's another thing I wanted to talk about because I never looked at her Instagram. Pull the shit up. Because she, she doesn't look but slutty but, at all. But at all. I don't see what the issue is. Look would you mind if your girlfriend was a slutty surfer? I don't care. Like I'm this, him. I knew what the hell I well, got depends. into. Like none of this it is depends. bad. None of this looks. Go uh, up. So if you, like right, go down, go down. Let's say like that right there. That one in the middle. I like this that one? one in the middle. No, the one in the middle. Yeah. Let's say yeah. that one. If your girlfriend was posting pictures like this, would you have a problem? Okay. And go go up. I don't, go I don't up mind one. that one. Go, go like up if she's one. there, like like go up one. Showing picture. her ass, like bending, like then I'd be like, yeah, this is weird. But this is the, I yeah. see nothing wrong with go this. Go up one. How about that one? She's this like, one? God, no, the the one in the middle. Click this on one? it to make it bigger. Uh, I can't. Okay, no. But oh, this I, one, right? Look You're at talking her. About? I can horn it up with these <laughs> with a wave, like a, like a squirter. 
She's yeah, look at squirting that. She's all telling over people the I squirt. But also the way he described it in text, I thought pulling up her Instagram, I was going to see them? like fucking. All of those pictures seem very cute and from the yeah. 1950s. Yeah, but it doesn't matter. Like, I'm not going to be able to, I'm not going to label someone a creep from weird text like that. No, no. I'm not I don't know the context. Like, I'm not going to label someone an abuser from, like, I'm like, we don't have information. But we she don't gave know. off weird uh, Amber Heard vibes. By by bringing up yeah, shit three years out of after, context, it's like three, nah, yeah. you kept that shit in your back pocket, and yeah. you want to. That's mad. That's yeah. weird. That's super sus. That's, that's a, weird. That's a so. girl that's pissed that he left her. Yeah. Oh but yeah. He left her. You're having she... a baby. Okay. Well, guess what I could yeah. do. It's like that's that's yeah. That's nasty. like a goddamn whore. That's weird. <laughs> yeah. That's exactly. Weird. So 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 you wouldn't be a uh, Poseidon. You wouldn't be jealous like that. Nah, these are regular pictures. They're not. Like I, I, I what see. What would it take for you to be jealous, Poseidon? Je- Are je- you ever je- like? What, what would it take for you to be jealous, Poseidon? Jealous, Poseidon. That's a good name. Jealous, Poseidon. Like, like if she posted pictures. Yeah, like yeah. your girl. Oh, like if she posted like really like provocative shit. But what's provocative? That's the thing, because that's yeah. what the line is, right? Like, what would you consider is the limit? Like, if you, it, w- what about your chick working out? Depends. What do you mean depends? Because it all depends. So you don't want you your chick doing working Pilates? out. <laughs> no, because it depends. Because we know we know the thirst traps, right? What? On Instagram, the thirst what? traps. Carry on. I don't know what a thirst. A thirst trap, trap is, is like chicks will post stuff just just for attention. Okay. Yeah. That's so what most posts. So if she posts a thirst trap. Ah, I'm gonna be a little against it, but if it's just a regular picture working out. But what's a regular? Picture uh, but I don't know. I don't know. Like, I don't know. Like okay. So look, a thirst trap is her like bench pressing, but with a dildo in her mouth. <laughs> So thirsty for cock. <laughs> yeah, there might be a line there. Yeah. That's very thirst trappy. Yeah. Okay, like you see, I wouldn't be, I wouldn't be with a, a girl like this. Let's say. Okay. You wouldn't be with a black girl. So how did you okay. know what so name to write on pers- Instagram? <laughs> <laughs> I wouldn't be with a. Look at the personally. Fucking, personally, this is too much for me. I couldn't. I couldn't. I, I. I wouldn't be able to be with a chick like this. So but that's just me. You, are you that's just me. saying that you wouldn't be able to be with her because she wouldn't I'd be able want to, I'd, anything to do with yeah, you? Yeah, I'd yeah, be yeah. able to fuck her, but I wouldn't I be able to. Would, I wouldn't I be able to have a relationship. No, uh, she's out of my league. That's for sure. Yeah, she wouldn't. Exactly. She wouldn't bat an eye at me. But, I'm just, but you guys thing. asked me, so I'm answering. Okay, okay so her, <laughs> even though you want to sleep with her, knowing that she would never sleep with you, you would reject her preemptively. No, no, no. no. I'd sleep with her. Are you crazy? No, but so, I wouldn't so date let's her. Let's say right now th- she doesn't take pictures, but your girlfriend goes to the gym like this. What would you say? Ah, uh, unacceptable. Does your girl go to the gym? Unacceptable. A hundred percent unacceptable. What is this? Did your girl go to the gym? You're going to sleep at the well, like what are you doing? Okay. What 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 does she need to wear at the gym? Apart from a burqa, what does she need to have on? <laughs> go fuck yourself. <laughs> what does your girl need to take with her at the gym? A robe? <laughs> like where's the limit? W- at point with the cursor? Yeah, yeah. Where should the shorts where, go? Where do the shorts end? At the ankles? Right about here. Like is, Bermuda? Is that, is that like yeah. Bermuda? Like, right like regular, regular and shorts. Do they have like to the be baggy? The regular shorts. The knee. Do, do they have oh, to no, be Oh, no, over the knee. Way over, like at the thigh. So you're you're a fucking, you're the, one of the old people from Footloose. Yeah. Like, can nah, she, bro. Can uh, she but, she, but this is, this is, is if you go to the gym to like this, you're asking for attention. You're, uh, you're being a thirst trap. But, and, there's, and I have nothing against that. I'm just saying. You have nothing against her asking for attention except what? for the fact that no, she's No, no, I have nothing against her, but it wouldn't be my woman. So you do have something against it. What? So you don't mind her, but if you saw her in the street, you would throw rocks at her head. No. <laughs> <laughs> That's haram. That's it's haram. haram. It's haram. Get out of here. <laughs> If she was your daughter, you would drive <laughs> into the Hudson River. Like, if you would go to the gym, because yeah. you go to the gym, yeah, and you would see that, would you go up to a girl and be like, Sister, come here, and then <laughs> hand her like an Andrew Tate. Uh, I would, book. I would, I would uh, fucking whip the fucking Quran at her. Fucking pow, bitch! No, I'm joking. Uh, these Muslims <laughs> do be need to talk about today. That became so. But yeah, okay. so so, but your girl does work out. So yeah. does your girl need to wear like baggy shorts? Nah, she, she wears wear she wears no no she wears leggings she wears, leggings, she wears pants, yeah a sweater. And a hoodie Yoga that says pants. my boyfriend will rape No, but you guys, you come on, admit, this is provocative. So, like, who yeah, goes yeah, to the yeah. gym like no, this? No, I know, I know, I know. Like, that you know, is provocative. I like, wouldn't care. But it's provoked yeah. by intrigue. <laughs> I wouldn't care. Uh, uh, everyone's yeah. different. Everyone's different. Yeah. So, I, but I think guys that are jealous, it's all insecurity. 
Yeah. yeah so you is. think you think that I don't think it is. No, because oh, yeah. sometimes no, you could be jealous because of what you said about Jonah Hill. Maybe she sucked the dick before. It's like, oh, I yeah. understand. I understand. I understand a guy being like, I don't want that. I don't want that kind of attention on my girl. It's yeah. not it's insecurity. It's like yeah. why? What, why? Who are you? Why doing are you this doing for? this for? Yeah. Why are you doing that? All that. Yeah. Like the no, no, but like but that. I'm t- I'm talking about him like saying she's got to wear fucking shorts lower than the knee. Like I think a girl can wear shorts that are mid thigh. Yeah, but that's and, what he said though. You didn't yeah. say that lower than the knee. Yeah, yeah, he did. No, I didn't. I no, said I said, I said like, like okay, I'm yeah, top thigh. Of the knee. Okay. But, yeah. Okay. Like, can she have shorts shorter than you right now? Yeah, that's pr- that's pr- pretty slutty. That yeah. is very yeah. provocative. Well, your very your shorts slutty. are to your balls. Yeah. Can <laughs> she wear shorter halfway through where you are? I guess yeah. Proper shorts. It's not worn like underwear. Yeah. We almost, well, that's well, okay, we that's almost see your ass. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. So it's just it just it just hugs her ass. That's it. That's all you. Yeah, want. that's bro, fine. Bro. That's Cover fine. Up, you and slut. and how about. <laughs> How about having guys over? Hi. <laughs> Hi, cover, Preach. Cover up, you slut. <laughs> How about having guys over? At well, the gym? When, when you're, no, but uh, like uh, when you're not home. Like no. if your girl invites oh, like guys over. Working. No, she you're not. Yeah. Guys from the gym. Nah, bro. We don't, <laughs> what but is it's it? just for, like she wants advice on working out and they're all gym nah. people. Yeah. <laughs> that doesn't fly like in a relationship. Her trainer. It's her trainer. Nah. It's trainer. doesn't fly in what a if, relationship. What if it's not gym related? Regardless. What if it's work related? No guy friends. Oh, no, no, guy guy friend. Friend. no guy friend. No guy friend. Even her brother? Well, no. Uh, He's not a mean? friend. He's okay. supposed <laughs> to be there. Okay. He's forced to be there. <laughs> Look at no, his looking. No <laughs> guy friends? What do you mean? No guy friends. At all. Yeah. She can't have no guy friends. The only guy I, know, I, she I, I find, I find that in weird in a relationship. Who's a lady. Hmm. I no find, guy friends. I personally find that weird in a relationship. To have guys, to Whether, be not, not, but not just like the chick. You. But even if the dude, even if the dude has like girlfriends and he j- and they hang out alone, I don't know. I, I find that you weird for a relationship. You just described him. Yeah, like all of his friends. Are, like but again, chicks. we're all different. Yeah. Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> Preach, I don't speak on behalf of him. Crazy. We're the same. I'm not we're like you. We're the same. We're the same. We're the same. I, I don't. Nah, he doesn't bro, speak for all of us. He doesn't speak for all of us. He doesn't speak for all of us. What about you guys? He doesn't speak for all of us. I'm just saying, we all. How about okay? So her brother is okay. Yeah. How about uh, her boss? No, her boss is weird. Her cousins. Her cousins. Because her cousins is fine. Dynamics. Okay, hundred percent fine. How about her hot cousins? hundred percent fine. Okay. How about her hot? What defines a hot cousin? Uh, well, her, her her cousins are good looking dudes. You all made. Right. I asked you what, and you're like, what the fuck did you say? I don't gotta I, go into details. <laughs> I want to fuck these dudes. That's all what you need to know. Did you say? Hey, yo. <laughs> I take back what I said earlier about the PFL. What the he wasn't doing it for vitamins. Yeah. What I think he's all the same. Hey, yo. Your cousins are That's just what they do. Dudes. They dig enough, and whenever they <laughs> dig, what they find, okay. Yo. Yo, you hey, can't hang out with guys yo. like some whore. Let me go talk to your guy cousin, see what they think about it. I'll be back next you week. Can't, you, can't, you can't hang around guys and bring guys home. Yeah. Because I'll you fuck do, them. Because if you do, I'll fuck them. Hey, yo. <laughs> hey, yo. You shouldn't have sex with your cousin Steve because his j- jizz tastes weird. <laughs> hey, his yo. jizz is disgusting. Hey, yo. But Barry. <laughs> Barry's got that sweet jizz. He oh. likes those pineapples. Yeah. <laughs> fruit. He's a fruity fruit. Let me tell you. Oh, shit. God yeah, damn. Fruity uh, But the way he said it was so funny. No guy friend. At all. But what's a friend? Like uh, someone that bangs you technically isn't a friend. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Yeah. Someone that bangs you isn't a friend. Well, isn't just that. a but friend. But somebody that bangs you could be a friend as well. No. What no. the fuck planet you're are you different. from? Yeah, you're a different. <laughs> what? Yeah, like I've that's, never that's, banged that's, a friend. That's you, never a never, never. you never had a fuck friend? You never had a fuck never friend? Never had a fuck friend. What? I don't, I don't believe in fuck friends. Yeah, because th- the boundaries are different then. Yeah. Mm. They're, they're not a friend. Like, let's say a fuck friend that you're banging, you're not going to take her around. Like, it's like, okay, so now you're dating. A fuck friend technically is a chick that you kind of like, but isn't girlfriend material. Yeah, yeah, maybe. Yeah. So it's not a real friend. But it's not a friend. You're not going to yeah. go to the movie. Like, I'm not going to go to the movies and then you're banging her. And that's kind of a date. Her, hey, yeah. this yeah. is what happened. Yeah, that's kind of a date. Yeah. So that I get. Obviously, you don't want to bang and dudes, that's, but that's not a friend. Yeah. I'm saying, what's the, what do you consider a friend? Like, what does your chick consider a friend? 
I don't know. I haven't thought you about You know what this. I mean? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Like uh, at work, let's say there's a coworker there and they laugh a lot. Like it's just fun at work yeah. and she goes home. That's a friend for her. Yeah, that's in, fine. I'm in, cool with that. But that's what I'm saying. But yeah. that's, I'm saying that's a friend. A friend isn't like, yo, this guy's trying to fuck her. Because then that's not a friend if he's trying yeah. to bang her. Yeah. That's something else. That's what I'm saying. So yeah, guy yeah. friends, do you really have a problem with it or you just don't want people banging your wife? Oh, no, no, I don't have a problem behavior. with it. Like if somebody's a friend at work or somebody's a friend at school, I don't give a fuck. So the limit is the the, the only the place venue. you don't want to her to have friends is a bedroom. Yeah. 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 Okay. It's a lonely place. No friends in the bedroom. <laughs> no, no friends in so the bedroom. What a, can a friend go over? But not like to watch Netflix. No. Like they're working on a class project. No. Uh. Like it's her birthday. Can a friend bring a, a present, or he has to throw it from his car? Oh, yeah, oh, he could bring a, a he could, he could bring a present. Okay, okay. Why well, not present? You, but 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 but. Yeah. <laughs> okay, when, but you have to. Be he there. has to bring one for me too. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so and it better be cake. <laughs> okay, so the boundary. And what I mean by cake? Cheesecake. Cheeks. Yeah. No, 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 uh, no. I, 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 bro, cake bro, I was, here, we were boy. not. <laughs> you. So cheesecake. The, the boundary. Cheesecake. Hey, yo. Cheesecake. So the boundary is. He can cheesecake. He Cheese can steak. go over the house or go over to drop stuff up. No, but that's the boundary weird. In our in a relationship, I find that weird. Whether it's the man or or the woman oh, doing no, no, that. No, no. So what I'm saying, but yeah. from what you said, let's say right now the guy shows up yeah. to drop off a gift to your girlfriend because yeah. they're friends. You're against that. You're like, this guy can't come here. But Wh- if you, why is he bringing gifts to my girl? It's her birthday. It's her birthday. But why are they that close? Yeah. It's her goddamn birthday. It's her are friend, you bro? angry? Don't you have friends? Huh? Don't you have friends? No. That's a fact. That's true. <laughs> <laughs> Don't have friends. No. How sad is that answer? Assuming she's normal, God she might have a couple. Bro. Okay, so uh, hold on. Is that cool with you? Bro. For my girlfriend's friend to bring her a gift? Yeah. Yeah, of course. What am I going to tell someone you can't buy a gift for my bro. girlfriend? That's retarded. It's according to his basis. You understand what I'm saying? Like, he ain't got no friends. Okay. So that's his net neutral. God damn. So yeah. she's not supposed to have friends. No, whoa, whoa, whoa. that's you not what I said. better hope that your girl doesn't know how to screen grab. <laughs> <laughs> that's not what but I hey, said. How funny would it be if he tells his girlfriend, you know how to fucking surf? You can't surf. <laughs> yeah. And she's like, just surf, yeah. pa. That's fucking right. You're <laughs> damn right. Now you're paying attention. Uh. She's like, I don't know what surfing is. But yeah, so, the ba- so even if you're there, what if you're at the house? And the friend comes and brings a gift. And then oh, that's cool. Okay, so that's what I'm saying. Is the boundary the friendship or you not being there? Because like it's me not being there, things. I found that all, all that okay, shit. Okay, so weird. it's not the, the gift. The boundary is that because yeah. another... you were making it seem like the gift was the problem, but now no, it's no, 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 it's uh, not the gift. Yeah. Yeah. Not the gift, the problem. Okay, it's just another dick that he's not sucking. Hey, no, <laughs> cheeks cake. Let me ask you a question. This guy <laughs> comes down here a lot. She's like sometimes, and I don't get to suck his dick. <laughs> There's just free cock roaming around here, <laughs> and I don't get to suck his dick. <laughs> Listen here, whore. <laughs> That's funny. Well, he comes here and he suck his dick. Yeah. How about and if you the go guy where's my like a lady? You go into the room like a goddamn lady. This isn't for your eyes. How about if the guy's ugly? Oh, like retarded, like ugly. a uh, like a disgusting ugly. Nah, still unacceptable. Like so borderline handicap. Nah, you just, know she doesn't look, have I standards. Think, I think. Look, if we're all like friends and shit. Okay, how about this? Yeah. You know uh, Sonia von Sasha? Yeah. You know the dude she bangs in the wheelchair? Yeah. How about if that guy was your girlfriend's friend? And they chill alone and shit? Unacceptable in a relationship. A paraplegic? A guy yeah. who's, whose legs don't work? He, yeah. he, he talks through a microphone? Yeah, the, she's only going to ever need two men in her life her father and me. But it's not need. What? That's what? Weird. Why would her dad bang her? Is number that, one? that is so Her dad should not weird. be touching her that way. No, what? She thing. only needs two, two dicks. No. no two men. Da- okay. That's two not men. what I said. Two That's men. not what I said. Two two bro. You guys are fucking putting two me in a quarter two here. Two men. Two men. Two men. Right. He said two men. And not at the same time. Okay. Right? So do yes. you get the ass or the pussy? Oh, God damn. Ah, the dad chooses. Ah. He made it. Ah. He chooses it. No, but I've So even with a guy that can't do anything, he's just handicapped and she's just talking to him like... Even that, because that is like, it's it's like, it's it's a paraplegic. Can he suck his paraplegic dick? Is that no. why you're mad? No. You're like he can't get hard. Fuck no. this guy. He's not a real man. He can't. He can't I know, Alain. He can get hard. Can get hard. <laughs> yeah. Oh, now it's they're never yeah. be friends. It's done. Yeah. Oh, forget about. How it. How funny if Poseidon actually think he's like you could be friends with him, and then Mike's like he, that guy could get hard. He's like. 
Get back in the house. <laughs> <laughs> and you, I'm blocking the elevator. You're not going up those stairs. You, yeah. <laughs> Look, listen here, lady. You're waiting up there's those no, stairs. There's no handicap access in my building. Exactly, yeah. There's no <laughs> for a reason. I know <laughs> what you handicaps are up to. Trying to fuck my there's, wife. Y'all saw, well, well, what's his name? Uh, access in your uh, girl's on. pussy. What, what's his name? Uh, the... Um, the guy there, the scientist, bro. Stephen, uh, Stephen Hawking. Hawking. Stephen Hawking, bro. He had mistresses. Yeah, he did have mistresses. Can't did, trust yeah. his handicaps, bro. Besides, besides not trusting anyone. Can't trust his handicaps, bro. I don't one, trust myself. You think I'm going to trust somebody that can't walk? the modem. Besides, going to walk in, <laughs> see red, beat the shit out of everyone. <laughs> Take the motive and beat the guy and his wife at the same time. Are you afraid? You see, you get this one over me and the guy's like, Je ne comprends pas, monsieur. <laughs> Are you afraid that, that you're going to get too jealous for like random shit that isn't, doesn't even exist? What's too jealous? No. Find it? Like just yelling at your girl for doing something that she didn't do? Didn't Wait, you? what? 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 Yeah. Because like, you seem like uh, like you yeah. you see shit that doesn't exist. Oh, like did you fuck Alain? She's like, I don't even know the fuck that is. Like that <sighs> kind of thing. Yeah, I don't know. I'm not understanding is the hyper? question. Like, uh, would you ever start an argument over something that's in your head that you have no proof on? You're just suspecting. You're like, it smells like dude in here, or so like, would you ever start shit on that, or would you investigate? No, I would investigate. Do you do you argue a lot with your girl? No, we that's haven't argued lie. in a while. Okay, that's a lie. No, we haven't argued in a while, actually. Okay. When we first what moved in, we argued a bit. What's a while? Like a, a day? Uh, a couple months. Okay. A couple okay. months? Yeah, 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 a couple months. Okay. Word. When Word we first moved in, uh, we were arguing a bit. What was the argument about the last oh, one? Just dumb shit. I hope the last one was about a guy in a wheelchair. No, no, no. no. <laughs> I don't even. That's the worst part is, I don't even remember. The last argument you know was, was this motherfucking huh? handicap. Oh, it was always dumb. We don't even remember the arguments. She does. <laughs> I, women, I don't remember yeah, women, what they're women, about. Yeah, <laughs> she, remembers. <laughs> she remembers. Yeah. I don't. She, she, she remembers <laughs> if you gave her a crooked look. Yeah. Yeah. As a chick, she remembers. She's if you gave telling her all of her yeah. friends if she, that are ladies. <laughs> that, yeah, yeah. <laughs> chicks, will, chicks will remember, and they'll be like months later. Yeah. So that night, did you feel like like they'll remember nah. shit that you don't? She right. can have gay dude friends. Ah, uh, hold on, gay dude. Hold friends. on, but what is gay? Because apparently, but I gotta check. But but hold on. Yeah, how do you check? Hey, oh, he yo. finger finger or mouth. I'm just saying. If they don't let me suck your dick, it's kind of strange. Free shit, anymore, bro. But so you cool with her having gay friend, gay dude? <laughs> no, so just you're a friend. Uh, <laughs> yeah. You're a friend. Hey, I'm an ally, bro. Gay friends are she allowed for real? I never thought about that. That's a good question. <laughs> gay friends is that cool? Three gay guys. <laughs> this motherfucker said I lie. <laughs> Three gay guys. <laughs> Bro, I don't know that's what you're asking. Group. These are all hypotheticals, that's bro. A, I didn't think that's about, a good question. They're all hypotheticals. Because bisexual, bisexuals kind of look no. gay, Oof. but they're not gay. No. So but how do you know? How, how can you tell the difference between a bisexual and a gay guy? You gotta the check. way he talks to her. Because you know the Fab Five, the, the queer eye for the straight yeah, yeah, guy guys? One, the one from Montreal isn't actually gay. He's just a, funny. a bisexual a guy. That's funny. Money. And and he's a he's like bisexual. And I, I read an article about him, and he said he had never had. He only had girlfriends before being so on that show. So he just says he's bisexual. Never yeah. fucked. He's so, like I'm making money. So he was kind of like a, a gay straight guy. And he just played hard yeah, to get. Yeah, but bisexual, that's like gay with a lot of steps. Yeah. yeah, no, but he, and now, like, I, I'm pretty he, sure now he's only banging dudes because he's like, I'm I'm a millionaire. That's gay. Or I could go back to banging chicks and I'll just be the effeminate guy that makes $17 an hour. <laughs> no, no, let him bang dudes. Yeah. yeah. So how about that guy? No, that guy's not to be trusted. He flipped <laughs> to a, Poseidon, I beat him to it. That guy's not to be trusted. He flipped this is, around this to is, uh, this He's was gonna the... fuck Poseidon and his wife. What, why why do you have a picture of a couch? This is this was a bisexual couch. I love bringing this up when every time we talk about bisexuals cuz he said gay with steps. And this was on Amazon. It was a I couch. When you change or to end bisexual bisexual couch. Yeah, when nobody you believes you. Or to end nobody believes. And it became a huge what meme and it was is, hilarious. I'm having, just, I'm, I'm having a stroke. When you change nobody or end no I don't know what exactly, it says. but when exactly. You, yeah. when, you when you change, change or to end, <laughs> or and no, it says when you change you. or to end, nobody believes you. So it's basically if you say uh, I'm, I bang chicks or dudes or chicks and dudes, no one's gonna believe you. But it doesn't make this is stupid. Yeah, this I is was stupid. bringing this up. There's so many hands, so they make all of the bisexuals 
look like fucking grabby. Oh, I got fucking it. Yeah, 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 yeah. I got it. I'm just fucking. Yeah. This is why we can't take the gay or serious. To and nobody believes you. All right, yeah. cool. Yeah, I yeah. get it. Jesus Christ, I'm slow. Why would you want <laughs> that on your couch? Like, I don't have a couch that says I bang chicks. <laughs> But I, dude, I was thinking about this. I want to write a bit about it, about flags, about, you know, because it's not just a gay flag. There's, if you look, there's a whole, there's a lesbian flag. The lesbian flag is the only one with weapons on it. There's two axes on it. Oh, really? Oh, yeah, it's true. Crazy. So there's all flag for anything. Pansexual, they have their own flags. Yeah. And it's like, I was thinking about it because normally a flag, like you have, it represents something like, hey, I'm Greek. I'm Canada. I'm military. I'm stuff like that. It, there is something funny about you yelling, I suck dicks. I suck. There is something funny about that, that we have so many flags. I think they changed it about to this. sexuality. That's the lesbian. But flag. then again, yeah. I'm pretty sure a lesbian feels more like a lesbian than a Canadian. No, I know, but it's what you're saying with it, right? One, you're saying I'm a yeah. citizen of this country. The other one, you're saying I eat <coughs> pussy. It's just yeah. a weird thing to yell out. But it is fun. Look at that. That's, that's a, a cool flag. That looks that like, looks that's like, like a Viking. That's the, that's the cool. That looks like a He-Man yeah. flag. Yeah, the lesbians are the best. Yeah, yeah. they have the best one. Ask for yeah. what's the meaning. Oh, what's the one with the hey, fucking man. kiss? That's a uh, kissing, what's it called? Kissing lesbians. I think that's just chicks that get drunk and make out other chicks. Uh, they have their own flag. Uh, They're okay. very niche, the flag. The double axe known as uh, Labris represents the strength and feminism of homosexual women and was adopted into the lesbian community in the 1970s. The Labris is also featured with, within Greek and Roman mythology. So they're just appropriating my culture, these lesbians. Associated uh, with... I'm going to ask the government to step... Lafria, up. Artemis, and... Uh, De Artemis. De Artemis. De yeah, so that's, that's the yeah, lesbian flag. Cultural, the lesbian, that's what they love to do, is appropriate cultures. Right. I'm actually sick of it. Yeah, uh -huh. They're doing the Greek face. They're doing the Greek face, and you know what? I'm sick and tired of them yeah. doing this. I would like to negotiate with one of these leaders, as long as they look cool. And uh, we'll talk about it. Ooh, lesbians. W w yeah. Can your chick hang out with lesbians? No. For real? She can't hang out with lesbians? Well, hold on, hold on. Hot lesbians or ugly lesbians? Regardless. Regardless? You think your chick would actually go for spaghetti, an ugly lesbian? Spaghetti, spaghetti is straight until it's wet. Uh, okay. <laughs> Shut the fuck up. Is that a real expression? Shut really that's a real expression. Mouth, Who says Get that? Get the what is your girl girlfriend identify no. as? Linguini? <laughs> your fucking goober. Hey, she's yeah. half this Italian. is your goonie goo goo. She's she half fuck Italian, up, right? <laughs> Spaghetti, get the fuck out of here, I, man. Can I say something about Poseidon that I love that he said that? Because it fits his and character. And he said that shit like he said something. <laughs> yeah, uh, yeah, yeah, I, I said thinking, that shit. Yeah. Uh. What I love about what he says is it fits his character because Poseidon still is like, yo, gay is a choice. Yeah. <laughs> And this bitch might choose to be gay. Yeah. That felt very Adam and Eve, not yeah. Adam and 100%. Steve. A hundred percent. Yeah. A hundred percent. I love Poseidon. He's like, 100%. I'm against gay shit. But it's a hot dude. You bro. might convince me to suck a dick. I hey, love him. Cheesecake, bro. What does that mean? Cheesecake. Oh, cheesecake. cheesecake. Yeah. Like cheesecake, but cheeks. Oh, just, I didn't get that one. Okay. The booty warrior. The booty, no. the booty, dude. Booty I warriors. That's shit. a good name for a gay street gang. Mm. That that's 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 a guy. The booty warrior. Yeah, that's an awesome the name. The booty warrior. What's his name? Um, there's a guy named the booty warrior. That's what his name is because he was talking about some shit. Like you, it's a dude that they interviewed in prison. Oh, the, uh, no gay talking. stuff ever God happened. Damn, that's so scary. Meeting a guy oh, in prison you, called the if booty you warrior. Watch the video is oh. even worse. I want you, and I'm a oh, half. If I met this was in the we, Boondocks, we could, yeah, but this based on a real guy. If no, I met, if I met oh, this the is the guy in the UK warrior in prison, no, in the States. I would become the booty suicider. Yeah, I would. I would kill myself right away. I would want to be. Says, I'm the booty warrior. I'd be like, okay, I'm just gonna commit suicide. If they call you the booty warrior, no, no. If I'm, I'm in a in a cell with the booty warrior. You I'd, just have to shit you yourself repeatedly. Video? The booty warrior? No, but wait, hold on. So uh, he just fucks anyone he wants? He just, he's in prison. He wants Does he you know get what? Fucked? Som sometimes, sometimes. Uh, oh, fuck, I found it. Fleece, the, fleece, 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 fleece Johnson. Is more important than breathing. Yeah. Because the booty warrior sounds like he gets fucked. Nah, he fucks. He fucks. He, gets he goes to fuck. war oh, yeah, against he these goes booties. He goes to war with the bo booties. There was also a dude like this in the UK, humongous uh, uh, black fellow. Okay. And, oh, that uh, guy's definitely not allowed to hang out with. And he would, he would, uh, he would, one hundred percent. And then, um, and then he would basically wait outside the gym, and he'd wait for dudes to get out, and he'd go and strike up a conversation with them, and he'd try to get them to hang up, and then uh, to hang up, to hang out, and then he'd basically try to rape them. 
Where is this guy? In the so UK. why We're would safe. he strike up, a, strike up a conversation if he's just going to rape them? Oh, yeah. Well, he would like try and seduce them and bring them back. And like, then you want to come to my place? I got a big, di- uh, I got food <laughs> and the, the game, the football game. What but I found, the, like? I found the booty warrior. Uh, yeah, that's him. That's, that's him. the real one? Yeah, Fleece Johnson. His name is Fleece? Fleece about the Johnson. Fleece the masses. <laughs> it's the Fleece. You put some song? What a yeah. weird fucking When lockup visited Kentucky State. That's on State MSNBC. I'm going to lower the volume a little bit. God damn, Cabo's oh, dead. Oh, we have to listen to the practices of a very different kind of Fleece Johnson. A different kind of homosexuality. We don't hear shit. Yeah, uh, we we need volume. Oh, sorry. Hello? Do you guys hear now? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, all of them's horny. He's not wrong. All of them's in horny. None of them are horny, fleece. <laughs> Put the volume up. Yeah. <laughs> oh, <laughs> what? Oh, he's disgusting. The story that Fleece told us was about the. I hope he raped this guy. He, he looks. He looks. He looks into it. He looks into it. Security penitentiary. Dude, why is he so happy that men are getting raped? <laughs> he's a producer from SNBC. Booty was uh, more important than food. Goddamn. A man's butt. It was more important. I'm sorry. Why is it bugging you? It was more. I love he's crying. Having some booty was more important than drinking water, man. I get it. This, that's a safe. Hey, cheeks cake, bro. <laughs> Johnson wanted like to tell booty. our crew how he used to satisfy his sexual desires. You know what would be amazing? Especially Look at the fuck how he sold his cigarettes. If he was, he was telling the producers, he was like, I'll tell you what happened. Uh, but it's a secret. When Come I in this room with me. <laughs> and he looks oh. good to me. When so, I go see and I'm Fleece saying, Johnson listen, listen. isn't that big. As I'm telling you what, uh, I like you, and I want you. And uh, uh, we can do it the easy way out of the hallway. <laughs> Oh man. Yeah. Choice is yours, man. Choice is yours. And it was always yes. Johnson. It was always yes. For the new generation of inmates. Yeah, but he's not that big, though. Fleece trouble Johnson. from old timers. Yo. You know, Fleece Johnson, charisma on yeah. fleek. Yo. Yeah. He's not that big, though. A no, lot but of those guys are charismatic. But he's scary as fuck. But I would, I would, Fight if him. someone told me we can do this easy way or the hard way. The hard way is the best way. Yeah, I'd fight him. Because I, I, you're going to get yeah. fucked in the ass yeah, exactly. anyway. So, But I, he, he said, I went up him and I said, I like you. I like you. Thank you. But I, I, I wonder what he... Yeah, imagine just like Poseidon, thank you. oblivious. Thank you. I like you. Poseidon's oh, like, thank you. I like you. I like you. I'm a pretty good dude. He's like, no, I mean... It is a reciprocal, my good yeah. man. <laughs> I mean, I really like you. Poseidon's like, well, I don't know you well enough yet, but I might really like you. You seem like a cool dude so far. <laughs> and I want you. Yeah, you like, want, I want me to do what? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> What do you want to do? I don't, I, don't, I, don't, I don't do things. I'm in here because I'm a criminal. I cut a lot of corners. And then he's like, no, no, no. I, I want that ass. And Poseidon's like, not my girlfriend's ass. My girlfriend's are mine. He's like, yours. Woof, thank God, bro. Yeah. <laughs> you're good. Person. You're a friend. Yeah, you're a friend. But I can't give you my ass because that would be gay. Would you like me to pleasure you orally, sir? <laughs> I'm not gonna give you my hand, but I'll fuck you. <laughs> Fleece Johnson. Hey, yo, Fleece Johnson. I Sorry. hope that Fleece Johnson is just in prison. For something like parking tickets, he just I got he out. Like he, I hope he stole he a TV and started years raping inside. He just got out. Forty, he? yeah, yeah, and he oh. he was in an interview, and it's like the guy's like, so, well, since you got out, uh, do you miss? And he's like, booty, yeah, no, <laughs> <laughs> uh, and he's married. But what? He's like, he misses uh, booty. Wait, to a man or a woman? He's just a gay guy. Uh, he's talking about man booty. Okay, he's okay, just okay. a gay guy that he's angry now that he has to bang a lady. You think? Yeah, yeah, definitely. You can't, you can't you be can't having sex with all these men much. and not be a gay guy. Yeah, the whole right. fucking prison makes you gay thing is bullshit. Of course, that's part of my joke. Yeah, yeah. yeah. you're just gay. Yeah, you're just gay. You fuck. If I was in prison, I'd just jerk off. I and if well, a that, guy rem- tried to fuck me up the ass, I'd shit my pants all the time. Remember what they told us when we went to the uh, prison in Sherbrooke? Yeah. What, do people do a lot of rapes? He said not that many rapes, but everyone's just jerking up. There's semen everywhere. Yeah, he said. yeah. There's, if we took a blue light to this fucking place, it was a black light. Do you see come everywhere? It'd be lit up. Yeah. yeah. God damn. Yeah. The, like you the, there, no? Yeah, no, I remember. Must be. Okay. Yeah. 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 Ye
Yeah. Ooh, this vroom, shit vroom. must be clogged. Yeah, 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 it's insane the amount of cum. It's the same as his bedroom when he's out of town for time. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> when the cousins are in town. Oh my, the hot cousins. <laughs> hot cousins. I hope I meet them one day and be like, oh, the hot cousins. You it's met like, them. Oh, I never met them. Yeah, you did. I've never met your girlfriend's cousins. Yeah, you have. No, I haven't. Yeah. Please tell us when how When you I picked met. up your wife. What? For uh, my girlfriend's birthday party. I met your cousins. Are you talking about when I was Her in the cousins. car? Yeah. When I was in the car and my wife stepped into the car and I left? Yeah. Well, I you saw them. Oh, get the fuck out of here, bro. <laughs> I met, they were standing there. So you saw That's insane. When you were driving on the 40. They they were, hold on, hold on. You spoke, you spoke to them. They said hello and I everything. didn't speak to anyone. Or they, they spoke to you, yeah. There was one guy yelling. Yeah. That's it. There was one dude. Being, hey, blah, blah. And I was like, oh, okay, merci. And then that's, that's literally. Yeah. And I didn't know they were cousins. Well, one guy. Oh. Yeah. So when I meet them next time, I will ask them, are you the hot cousins? Yeah. And then they will ask who described me as a hot cousin. The guy that took your dick. The guy that <laughs> took your dick. <laughs> <laughs> the guy who's using your, your cousin as a beard. So we don't know he's gay. <laughs> that guy. Beard is a good term we got to bring back. Yeah. Beard for what? Beard w- the for it's a it's a gay uh, it's a when a gay guy is with a lady the lady is a beard. <laughs> that's yeah. a good one. Yeah. yeah, that's your beard. That's a good yeah. one. That yep. Yeah. I I knew a couple of friends uh, that I knew man because one of them I was con- I was sure that he was a gay guy and then the chick I was like I kind of got it lesbian. Was a beard? I, yeah, I got lesbian vibes from her and then what ended up happening was I found out later that they were just. Both gay and just pretending that that relationship so that their parents. Oh, they didn't one know ask. either one. Uh, no, they need, both knew. Okay, they it both was kind of like okay. you know they were together, about. so that their okay. parents. Yeah, yeah, yeah but that, while they were together, one was eating pussies, the other one was okay. sucking dicks. Okay. Yeah. And not the one you think. Yeah. Yeah. yeah exactly. So it's, it's pretty interesting that people still do that. Yeah. Yeah. It's a good term. Anyways, uh, we're back from Toronto, yeah. Mike. But the Suzuku doesn't stop. If people want to catch episodes of Suzuku, they go to patreon.com slash Suzuku. Uh, new episodes drop weekly. You can watch them live because Mike does them live from the Bordello from around the world during the world tour of Suzuku. Uh, we have, I have the Little Bell this Thursday. There's one this Thursday at uh, Brossard. Preaches on that lineup. Sure. Beside it might be hanging around the back. Uh, Maxi Martin. Uh, Are the Charles. hot cousins coming? The hot cousins <laughs> might come. Out. They're, they're fans. They're okay. fans of Brossard. People I love. Better not, I better not hear cock cock when I'm on. Go, the go, 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 go. Like, c'est mon like, cousin. Oh, shit. So Thursday, that's happening. Me and Preach and Emil, we have the outdoor show at Just for Laughs coming. There's a Montreal show going to be announced, which me and Preach are also going to be part yep. of. You got the nasty show. You're going to be yeah. hosting that shit every single night. So whenever they get Except tickets. Except the 22nd, I'm in Quebec City for Suzy Kut. Okay. The third biggest uh, podcast in the history of podcasting. 10,000 tickets at the Centre Vidéo Tron. God yes, damn, sir. Absurd. Mm. Uh, preach, Abba, and preach on the YouTubes. If people aren't subscribed, I don't understand what the fuck they're waiting for. If you want to get your news of what's happening, I get it from you guys because you guys talk about it, so I know it's worthy for me to know about it. Don't and get your news from us. I do. That's where I get my news. Because uh, or else I wonder what anyone's talking about. Yeah. So I go from them, and then they they break it down, and I'm like, oh, that's what's happening. Okay, that's how I learned about Andrew Tate. That's from these guys. Check us out. Yeah. Check that out. Poseidon is online. It's the Poseidon 69 Twitter and on Instagram. He has a website, IamPoseidon.com. Not me. He is IamPoseidon.com. Pantelscomedy.com for all of my stuff. Patreon.com slash Pantelis. Thank you and go fuck yourselves. Boom. Bam.